There are several different interpretations of what the title and first line of the song should be, but I think the one that I like best is bright morning stars in the plural, as opposed to the singular, arising. Because although some people think that there aren't really morning stars because they disappear when the sun rises, actually they still are there, you just can't see them. And in addition, we have our own star, the Earth stars, or our own personal star rising. And um, there are also references to bright morning stars being angels. And because this is a beautiful old spiritual, it originated probably in the Appalachian Mountains, um, that those layers of meanings, I think, just make it very beautiful. And I also just love some of the lines in the song. So, where are our dear fathers? They are down in the valley praying. So it seems like somebody is going on a journey or they're walking through a village and they can't find the men, where have they gone? And they're down in the valley, they're praying in a church. So um, maybe something kind of tragic has happened or maybe they're just praying. 
Uh, either one of those is, is just a very nice image. And then the second line, where are our dear mothers? They've gone to heaven shouting. I just love those lines because perhaps there's some kind of a sickness that has gone through the village and some of the women have died and they've gone to, to heaven. But, or maybe there was a battle and some of the women died in fighting. So the women, they died, but they didn't go quietly. They, they weren't gonna go without a fight. They went shouting, so the women were awesome. I just love that idea. Or maybe they died because of a sickness and they're in heaven and they're shouting because they're so ecstatic to be entering the glory of heaven. So all those different levels of meaning just make the song very special, I think. If you'd like to help and encourage me to make more music videos, you can by pledging $1 or more per music video at my Patreon site here. When I first heard about Patreon, I thought, how can that possibly work? How can a donation as small as $1 significantly help an artist? But then I checked out the Patreon site, and there are a number of creators there who are living out their dreams, making art and music, because how it works is that if you get a large number of people, who pledge to give a small amount that really makes no difference to them, but uh, it completely adds up and just makes a huge difference for an artist, giving them freedom and flexibility to work on things that they love to do. So of course, a big shout out of thanks to my current Patreon patrons, especially my Bright Morning Star patron, Yaku. So take care and see you next time.